Hey guys, it's me again. This is part two of uh, the games I just showed you. It was ColecoVision and Atari. These are the rest of my Atari games. This is back in the day, VGR, your host here, Tony. Um, the rest of these are pretty cool games too. I hope you like them. And we'll see what we got here. Um, we have another one here. It's called Star Master by Activision. Uh, yeah, that's pretty cool. It's in really good condition. You, it's not wore out, as you can see. Uh, we got here, uh, let me see, Super Gorda, I think it says. Uh, if the, it's by Parker Brothers, and that played in the Atari uh, 2600. Uh, it's in pretty good condition, as you can see here. Um, let's see what else we got here. Uh, this is a really bad uh, 50 cents Parker Brothers uh, Cubert. Uh, the, the front is ripped pretty bad. Uh, it was only 50 cents, you know, but uh, it plays well. Uh, oh, geez, you know what? I actually got two of these. I got one that's uh, that has the paper on it that's in okay condition, which is right here. Uh, it says two dollars on the back, but I believe it was fifty cents or something like that. Uh, the one that's ripped here, if anybody's interested in trading me something for it, if they want it, I know it's ripped or something or trading something for something, just let me know. Uh, send me a message here on my YouTube and just let me know. I'm willing to get rid of that. Um, I have another one here, uh, Kangaroo for the Atari 2600. Another one right there, kangaroo. It's in fair condition. Um, this is a really, really weird one here. Uh, it, it's by, it says USA Games. It's in good condition. Uh, made in Taiwan. It's called Squeeze Squeeze Box. Uh, plays on the uh, 2600. It's a, look if you look at it, it's in very good condition. You know, it's nice and clean. You know, it says 99 cents on the back, and uh, that's what it looks like there. Pretty good condition, fellas and girls. Um, we've got another one here, too, uh, by Activision, which everybody's familiar with. Great game for back in the day and now. And they also made uh, future games of this, updated the graphics and all. Uh, people's favorite back in the day, uh, Pitfall. The front, the front of it is a little, you know, dirty, beat up. But at least, at least it's not ripped and you can see it. So that's not bad there. Uh, let's see what else we got here. This one is called uh, Phoenix. I mean, yeah, I think Phoenix for the Atari 2600. Uh, right here, made in 1982. It's, look, it's nice and clean. Uh, I, like I said, I keep them in the box and uh, they're in good condition. Uh, let me see what we got there. Uh, Wow, I forgot I even had this. Great movie that just came out recently, guys, a year or two ago. For the Atari 2600, when this movie was very popular in the 80s. Raiders of the Lost Ark. Look at that. Perfect condition. No scratches, no nothing. It's in really good condition there for the Atari 2600. Uh, Raiders of the Lost Ark. Wow. Uh, let's see here. Let me see what else I got here. There's some weird games. This is another one by USA Games. It says uh, Commando Raid. It's in very good condition. Made in Taiwan. Uh, this is what it looks like here. Uh, nice and clean. You know. The back is a little different though. You know how you, you put the game in the back and the back is, is full. You know there's no slits in it. This has a slit slits in it and where you put the game at. That's uh, pretty pretty different different there you probably see my big finger but that you know that's pretty different so uh, let's see what else we got here uh, what's this here uh, burst uh, what's this here bursting or something like that I don't know uh, there's another uh, another uh, uh, brainstorming I guess Activision game could be wrong on the, on the wording there uh, it's another one right there it's pretty good um, we got another one here by uh, you'll you'll never believe it. CB, CBS, 
CBS video game. Uh, it says it says Astro uh, Battle, Laser Attack, Space Warp, Flagship, and and it just it's really weird. Check this out. Uh, it's nice and clean. I guess this is rare. You know, it says ABC on it. That's that's oh, that's crazy. And uh, you know, there's the uh, front of that right there. Uh, let me see. Let's see what else here. Uh, what's this here? Oh, Yara's Revenge. Yeah, this one here, nice and clean for the uh, Atari 2600 fellas and girl gamers out there. We love you. Uh, let's see. Someone can kick your ass, you know. I, I played with a girl on Xbox. We played Halo Reach, and she was kicking my ass, man. I mean, there's some really, really good girl gamers out there. You know, I hats off to them. You know, I'm not racist against girl games or any girl girls playing games with us you know guys you can't be that way you know they're just as good or even better okay here's another game for Atari 2600 called Vanguard here's another one here nice and clean you know uh, good condition says 50 cent on the back there I gotta take these stickers off you know when I get a chance clean that up uh, let me see we got here let's see yeah here's a sticker on the front here it says set uh, 75 cents here let me let me take this off real quick uh, it's breakout. It's breakout uh, for the Atari uh, Atari 2600. That's what it looks like right there. Uh, pretty good condition there. Uh, let's see what else we got here. Uh oh, this is a good game. I used to love this game on the Atari 7800 uh, back in the day. Pole position, right there. Looks classicy. I love it. it. Was a great game. It was good for back then. It was pretty good graphics for the 7800. But that's it right there. Uh, well, oh, I'm sorry, guys. Pole position two. Excuse me. Pole position two. Um, here we got another one. Super breakout for the Atari 2600 here. Right here. Pretty good condition. Uh, that's another one there. It's a good game. My wife likes that game too. Uh, oh man, we'll do that one last. You're not gonna. You'll 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 see when I you'll you'll see when I tell you about it. This is another game too. It's by Parker Brothers. It's ripped pretty bad, but it was a really it was a good game back in the day. It has a little dust on it. A lot of people used to play this back in the day. It's Popeye. See Popeye there a little bit? Ah, eat me spinach. Somebody messed me game up. But that's it. You know, it's by Parker Brothers, and um, it was a really cool game. Uh, let's see what else we got here. Oh, man, another sticker, man. Jeez, I didn't know these were on here. Seventy-five cents it has on there. All right, that, I'll take it. Uh, let's see. It's called Adventure. Uh, it says three uh, three skill uh, levels for the Atari uh, 2600, 1980. Pretty good condition right there. Yeah, I'll show you that right there. Uh, let me see. We got another one here. It's uh, let me see. It's uh, from 1987. Uh, Jungle Hunt, right there. It's in real good condition there for the Atari 2600. Real good condition right there. Uh, let me see. Jeez, I'm leaving a sticker on this one, guys. This is ch uh, a Chopper Command by Activision uh, it, for the Atari 2600 right here. Uh, pretty fair condition. A little, little dirty, but uh, fairly well. Uh, here's another one. Man, this is. There's another one with the slits in the back. It's. Uh, Frogo Games, Sea Hunt. Uh, it says 2600 and 7800 system. Made in Taiwan. It's another one right there. Uh, really nice and clean there. Uh, let's see what else we got here. Uh, man, another Phoenix uh, game. You know, if anybody's interested in, in some of these Atari games and they want to trade me for them, um, that's fine. Um, you don't have to really buy them off me, but if you want to trade me for anything, you have Sega. Nintendo, what you know, old games. That that's cool. Uh, it's another Atari 2600 Phoenix in good condition. So if you want to trade me for that, uh, or that rip one I just told you about, I think it was a Cubert. Um, just let me know. Or right, I can give you both of them for one trade. So just let me know, and we can do business here. Uh, let's see. Here's another one. Uh, man, this is 
I can't even pronounce the name on here. It's called War, uh, Warp Lock. Uh, 1982 Data Age. Uh, the 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 cover's a little messed up, but uh, that's let me let me get it closer, guys. But uh, that's what it looks like right there. Uh, looks I, I like the cover. It looks pretty good. Uh, that's the front there. Uh, let me see. Uh, there's another. Uh, we got Circus here for Atari. That's another one in pretty good condition there, guys. Right there. We're going over 10 minutes here because I know we only get 15. Last but not least, one of the worst games ever made in Atari history. And I know you're going to know what I'm talking about. They had to actually they had so many of these games that they had to bury them in a landfill. And you guessed it right. E D phone home. Where's me recess pieces? But I do have one. I'm going to keep it because I'm a collector. It's in very good condition. Right here. It was a very horrible game. You know, a lot of people would say. But uh, I thought it was okay. It's not. It's horrible. But hey, I'm a collector. So. But that's it for my Atari game, guys. Uh, like I said, if you want to trade for those games I just told you about, just let me know. Send me a message. Uh, I would appreciate some feedback, you know. Uh, you know, subscribe to me. Uh, I got more, a lot more stuff. I just, you know, I haven't had time to really get everything out. But I will be um, showing you my ColecoVision um, boxes of some of my games, uh, my Super, a my, well, my Nintendo, my TurboGrafx-16, uh, a few games for my 3DO, my 3DO, Panasonic 3DO, and more. So thanks for tuning in, guys. Keep gaming. Talk to you later.